たよね。
nasty. It's kind of nice to have a little break and like feel their desire to buy some. Because it can be a little bit consuming. Feeling really caught up and wanting to get every new thing. struggling a little bit with my short form content at the moment. You might have noticed, you might, you might have noticed that I've been publishing or posting last short form content. It's because every time I go to edit it, I'm like, no, oh, this isn't good. Like, the lighting isn't good or the audio isn't good. It's really intense when I get in this that space where I feel like overly critical and don't want to post anything. That is my perfectionist tendencies coming out to play, which is not a strength. <laughs> it is 100% a massive source of anxiety for me that I speak to my psychologist about. I'm going to go on with some of this Kaisas concealer, which is my current favourite. This is the perfect to turn for me right now. It's a little bit too dark for me when I'm at my winter shade, but it is perfect for my summer shade. But back to my challenge of posting short form. Just wanted to say thank you so much for everyone who leaves comments on my stuff. Like you don't know how motivating and amazing it is. I know it's probably not healthy, but I do read them all. Except probably the comments on my really viral videos, because there's just too many. You can really tell when it hits like the non-ASMR side of things, because people are always commenting like, why are you whispering? <laughs> Speak up. <laughs> it's like, bro, it's ASMR. It's literally in my name. And I whisper because I want to whisper. If I wanted to do content that's not ASMR, I would do that. But I don't want to do that, so... Deal with it. Find someone else to follow that is not ASMR, because that is not me. I'm gonna do my brows next. She was like, 
they get to the group. But it's just made like a really boring one dimensional one dimensional character. And also it's like eliminating goal like character arcs and growth. Like why have you done that? It'll make me angry, which is not conducive to ASMR, but it's such trash. The creators of the animated show are making more like animated TV shows and movies though, so I'm very excited about that. Yeah, I only made it like, I think through the first episode of the new Netflix show and then cancelled it. <laughs> but Avatar The Last Airbender is literally one of my favourite shows of all time. That and Sense8 on Netflix are my two favourites. But I'm not really watching any TV shows at the moment. Damani and I were watching this Korean zombie TV show called Happiness, which was really good. And we're watching another Korean TV show called Hotel de Luna, which is also really good. But I only ever really watch TV shows with him anymore. Like, I don't watch them alone because I'm always just reading fanfic. <laughs> which, if there are any fellow fanfic readers watching, please comment. Let me know what ships you read and what fandoms. I am just Harry Potter, though I did read a Sitara pick the other day, which is Zuko and Katara from Avatar The Last Airbender, who should have been Endgame. Um, but yeah, I've just been reading Harry Potter. I'm reading Drari at the moment, which is Draco and Harry. I started with, I started with Dramoni, which is Draco and Hermione. <laughs> I think Jaculus, which is James and Regulus, is my favourite though. But it's a pretty new ship, so there aren't as many fix. Though the ones that exist there are plenty of incredible good incredible good ones. Really good ones. But compared to like Durari, like a lot of really good fix were written like five, ten years ago or something. <laughs> I saw Zen Lin Yu, who's like a really famous fanfic author who wrote Manigold, which is amazing, and also the fanfic I started on, <laughs> which if you know, you know, it's a quite a heavy dark fic, but it is so amazing. Um, she's becoming a published author, which is so exciting, and so well deserved, like I've read plenty of fanfic that are better than published books. <laughs> Getting some to put on the knees. Going in with this eyeshadow primer. But yeah, all I've been reading is Harry Potter fanfic for like the last two years. It is all my mental health will allow. It's like a safe place to go. Eventually, I will branch out, probably to the fanfic. <laughs> I just love the tagging system and being like able to choose exactly what I'm in the mood for, you know. Okay. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of eyeshadow that's in this palette. I'll link them both down below, by the way, 
so if you're interested you can check them out. I'm going to go in with some glitter next from this Alicia palette, specifically that one in the middle. Thank you. 
setting spray, sorry, powder. I love it. As I said, incorporates two of my favorite things. 